All right, imagine this. You are a fitness influencer. You want to launch a new product and to kick things off, you want to create a large lottery so that your whole community can engage and one lucky person can win a car. Sounds like a fun idea, right? Well, that's what we did for Juan Farrells, which is a fitness influencer who has hundreds of thousands of fans. And we had to build this to run for 72 hours consistently. And here's the story of how we did it. Hi, I'm Ryan and we build software for clients, particularly like Juan, where basically you already have a business and you want to create a new product or a new marketing activity. And this is where we helped him build this product for him. So when we started the project, we didn't know how many people were going to engage in this lottery. So we some of the challenges that we went through was when we launched the lottery, people were buying tickets so fast, our systems could not keep up. So what did we do? Well, we took the tickets that were made and instead of generating them on the spot, we pre-generated them ahead of time so that when someone bought a ticket, we just emailed them a pre-generated ticket right away. And that solved that issue. Then the next hiccup happened, which is there was so much traffic on the server. So in our normal testing, we we're just using MySQL database, but on production, we use PlanetScale, which has 10,000 connections. And by using 10,000 connections, it could handle the load smoothly and didn't have any issues. Then the next thing was about security. So since there's a lot of payments going through our system and so much money was being transacted, we had to do pen, pen tests to make sure that there were no ways that someone could hack our system and game it so that they can get tickets for free. And then another robot we went to was that Stripe classifies certain businesses as gambling. And we'd be very careful how we set up our Stripe so that we could handle this type of client project and for him to keep running it smoothly. In the end of all this, Juan sold 200,000 tickets and made over $2 million in revenue. So I would say that's a win in my book. So what's the takeaway of this? Behind every cool event, every cool product, there's a lot of behind the scene work that goes on. The systems, the security, the payments, everything needs to be working seamlessly for things to work out perfectly. So if you're thinking about doing something similar to this, or you want to ask questions about how we did it, leave a comment below and we'll rep respond back to you. And if you found this story helpful, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel.